Assalamualaikum and a very good day. A great to all, to everyone watching this video. So this is our grammatical analysis by Sarvina, Pavitra, Maisara, Mariam, Fitri, and Fakirul, our group members. So let us start. Number one is when I was a kid, I always have this thought about having a big house, an expensive car, without giving a thought about the life experiences that I will have to go through from my high school days until adulthood. Tense error, use past tense for finished section. When I was a kid, I always had this thought. The author's thought was in the past, so we use past tense. Number two is conjunction. Use, use a conjunction between two objects about having a big house and an expensive car. Number two is when I was still in school, I had planned that I will continue my studies in culinary arts because I used to love cooking. Tense error, use the initiative infinitive after past tense plus two. I had planned to continue my studies. Had planned is past tense. I mean, had planned is past perfect. That I will continue is future tense. So it doesn't make sense in a sentence. So number three, even though I take accounting and art sub arts subject in school, I wanted to pursue my dream to be a chef. Tense error, use simple past for a finish action. Even though I took accounting. The other took accounting in the past, so we use past tense, yeah. So um, number two is subject, should be in plural. Art in the sentence is an adjective. And art subjects in school. I wanted to pursue my dream to be a chef. Adjectives must not be in plural. So number four is, however, it does not mean that I hate my job at the time. Tense are you simple present with does not. However, it does not mean that, that I hate my job at the time. The author states a fact, it does not mean. So we use present tense. So number five is, the people around me, especially my own family, gave a lot of advice regarding the studies in private universities. Even our personal doctor encouraged me to further my studies. Punctuation error, comma splice. Change the comma into a semicolon, period or m dash. Especially my own family gave a lot of advice regarding the studies in private universities, period. It, even our personal doctor encouraged me to further my studies. Comma splice makes it into a run-on sentence when it's supposed to be two sentence right number six is then i started my mission to search the list of private universities while while searching i came across this one link that mentioned unicell search the list implies that the list is missing and to search for it then i started my mission to search through the list of private universities Number seven, I was happy that I got it, but at the same time, I felt down because I have a very bad grammar, broken English, and did not have any courage to speak here in English. You named it. <clears throat> Tantan's error. Tantan's error. Use simple present. You name it. You named it is in past tense when the author is talking about present tense when the, the author th is talking about the prison. Eighth, perhaps I can start thinking about having a family. Sorry. Eighth, perhaps I can start thinking about having a family and help my parents after achieve my dream. Use present participle for an action that is still ongoing and helping my parents after achieving my dream. The author is still in the process of achieving her dreams and helping her parents, so we use present participle. Num next, number nine, like the quote by Aristotle, the roots of education are bitter, but the fruit is sweet. So that is why do not give up your dream to become what you want to be, even though it is different from what you have met before. Punctuation error, commas before and after quote. It should be a commas there. Like a quote by Aristotle, comma, the root of education is bitter, but the fruit is sweet, comma. So that is why, nine, um, we need to use commas before and after quote. The root 
is in plural so we use the plural all number 10 and the last one slightly i mean i love kids and i used to have a slightly interest on becoming a teacher when i was a primary school student much up of adverbs versus adjectives i used to have a slight interest on becoming teacher slightly is an is an adverb which is used for verbs adjectives and other verbs interest is a noun so we use the adjective slight um, so that is all from our group um thank you for watching from Sarvina Pavitra and Sarah Mariam Fitri and Fakrul um please give a comment like and subscribe thank you very much